My name is David Penn, and sometime soon... Sorry, David. I'm gonna die. Last time on Break a Leg. Yeah, uh, roommates, it's it's three X grooms and they're living with their yeah, we two XY. We read it. Name's Larry Gibbons. I'm supposed to be your bodyguard. I'm going to shoot the show in San Francisco. What? What about that Andy Corvell guy? The network head, you said he has money, right? Nobody has seen this guy for the last 15 years. Why do you insist on failing me, Sebastian? The cast is quitting. What's wrong with the cast? If he sends out that press release tomorrow, I'm finished here. And probably in the business. I want you all to meet Jimmy Scotch. He's gonna be our guest star, if CAG allows. CAG? The Child Actors Guild. Hey, don't you live underground or something? We live in the sewers. I can help you. This Stan Marley thing, I know him. If you want, I can make him stop the press release right now. I think Mr. Cougar should be fired. Is he fired or not? Don't really think it's my call. I, I think that we should fire Chase. Hey, it's Amber again. I'm gonna be at your house in a few minutes and I'll explain more about what we discussed earlier. Are you crying? Why are you crying? Miss Turnipseed. Yes? You're gonna have to come with me. He's got her. Sir. What? Call me sir. He's got her, sir. The whole thing! He's got her, sir. Gary Coleman. I like that. That sounds delicious. Say it again. Sir Gary Coleman. Good, good, good boy. Good boy. Hey. You know I'm the damn president of this guild now. You know that, right? I know that. I voted for you. I voted for Gary Coleman. I'm Gary Coleman now, not just Gary Coleman from different strokes. GFC. What's the F for? And the G and the C is for Gary Coleman, of course. I know what the G and the C are for. Now slap sir. women bigger than you, Willis. And Jimmy, sir, Gary, budging Coleman. Shut your damn mouth. I call everybody Willis because that reminds me of all the pain I've gone through in this life. Listen, once you have them, you'll be coming back to us immediately, you understand? Coming back? Oh, to the sewers. Yeah, I guess so, okay. Good, good. And then the plan goes as, as planned. Groommates will go on as scheduled, but without the star director. <laughs> you know those days where everything seems to happen all at once? Yeah, this is, this is gonna be one of those days. You know, in retrospect, this whole thing was probably a bad idea. David, we need to talk. Can't, middle of Borscht. Borscht can wait. I've been looking for you all day. Isn't this Sebastian's office? No, that's where I live. It's my home now. In the office? Yeah, they're actually standing in my bed. Oh. Does Sebastian know? Yeah, it's his way of paying me. It's his, his only way of paying me. Have you gotten a, a check or anything? David, we're in trouble. You, you do know I'm a writer, right? Not, not a therapist or Jack Bauer. Look, Chase wants to see me. What? Why? Ever heard of a show called Brewmates? Of course I've heard of Brewmates. Or, well, you, you know, I actually wrote it. Uh, Brewmates was, was my creative protest against formulaic, bland sitcoms. It was the animated story of three ex-brooms living with their two ex-knives. CNC liked the idea, but then, you know, they changed the brooms into grooms, and the ex-knives became ex-wives, and, well, Brewmates. Well, then you know it's on tonight at 8. What? Yeah. Immediately following Doomates. How's that, mate? We have competition, David. No one has seen the Groommates script except us and CNC. 
Okay, it could be a coincidence. Yeah, and I'm 5'9". She was 5'9". So what do, what do, what do you want to say? Francesca, you're saying that, that this is treason? You, you think someone's trying to overthrow the king? Yeah, 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 yeah,